guys, what's going on everybody? It's Miss Sammy Cam here and welcome back to another episode on the Bushcraft fan server. So today guys is episode number six and I just wanna start off by saying I'm really sorry guys, but I did I did actually record uh building the whole of the sugarcane farm. Uh, which we were going to do this episode, but my, well, I, I recorded the audio and then I deleted it but really stupidly. I forgot I exited without saving, I wasn't thinking. So I decided I'm just going to time lapse um, that part of me building the sugarcane. And then the second half of the video is going to be me looking around people's bases because I think I've been asked to do that quite a lot and I think t uh, today's the time. So. Hopefully you will enjoy today's episode and we're going to start off with the time lapse, so enjoy.
Alright guys, we are back, and I hope you enjoyed that little time lapse of me making the sugarcane farm. Uh, one thing I want to let you guys know is I will go and collect some sugarcane, because I didn't have any at the time I was recording. So I will go and collect some sugarcane and stock it up with that to start growing some. And there's a zombie back here. But yeah, we are back, guys. Uh, and we are at someone's base right now. We are actually at Snuggles and... Snuggles 0010 and Welly 27's base, and these mobs are getting really annoying. But uh, yeah, we're at their base, guys, and we are going to have a look at what they've been doing. Okay, right. So, let's start off over here, and then we'll work our way over there. So, I think this is kind of oh, this is kind of like a little um, place where they've kept their horses, maybe, and they've just lost their horses. Uh, so, this is pretty cool stable. There's a block missing there. I wish I could replace it. I'm sorry. Um... Am I getting shot at? I don't even know. Oh yeah, this guy is here. I'll save you, Welly. I'll save you. I'll save you. Yeah, I saved you. <laughs> GG. Um, all right. So here we've got a little wheat farm. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's a wheat farm. It's just a normal wheat farm. So I believe this is their house. They've got kind of like two houses. I think it's because they live together. Um, oh my god. Stupid creepy. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. Uh, I haven't actually got any armor. Where's my armor? I don't even know. Um, so I guess here's their house and stuff. So that's pretty cool. I guess that might have been a creeper explosion or just they've broken a hole in the wall. Uh, I think that was definitely a creeper explosion. But they've got all their chests and furnaces protected, which is good. So no one can steal from them. Oh, wait, this is Hammer Liam's? I don't even know if this is their house really. But um, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, oh, by the looks of it, this is my favorite bit. I saw this when I first came here. It's like a little Viking ship, I think. Um, I'm pretty sure this is theirs. Unless this is... I'm not really sure. They've got like a massive town. So I guess if this is someone else's base, then I guess I've shown this as well. But yeah, that's a really cool Viking ship. There are like this little kind of like port they've got. Uh, kind of like dock, I guess. And yeah. I swear that was alleys, but I don't know. I was probably mistaken. Alright, so now let's go over to their their house over here. Oh, I really like how it's like bush themed. Uh, they've kind of made use of leaves there. Um, I'm guessing that's all it, to orientate it to like bushcraft and stuff. That's really awesome. So let's look inside. I'm not sure. What, whose head is that? Is that like one of your your heads or something? Um, all right. So let's go inside. I like I like the nether brick here. I think that looks really cool. Uh, they've got enchantment tables. So they, it looks like they've got quite far really. Oh, and they've got a load of heads along here. Which I think they got from the 1v1 thing that we've got in the arcade. Um, oh, look, it's my head. <laughs> Lol. Um, so they've got crafting tables, they've got loads of furnaces. Oh, they've even got a jukebox, look, which is pretty cool. And if we go through here, it looks like they've got a few horses, which is really cool. Can I can I ride it? Oh, yeah, I can. Sweet. <laughs> um, oh, God, I just spawned outside again. But, yeah, this is really cool. They've kind of got the horse stable connected to their house. And uh, that's really cool. They've also got some flowers around here. Uh, and they've built in a really nice area as well. They, it looks like they've got like a little beach over here. And like, uh, do you like it? Yes. Um, a little beach out here. And look, I think that's their nether portal over there. So that's pretty cool. They've got access to the nether over there. And uh, I'm not sure what that is. It's like a fire? That's fire. And wood. I don't even know. Some some house is just burnt down randomly um all right so nice base and let's go on to the next one all right guys we are back and we are actually at atomic smiler's base uh which actually looks pretty awesome straight off from the start uh it looks like we've got a little forest surrounding this base and uh i've just noticed the um the mossy cobblestone inside their castle wall that's pretty cool and apparently there's rooms so we'll get to those later uh they've got a little carrot farm out here so wheat and carrots and maybe they've got a few potatoes growing there I'm not quite sure um, so they've got a ladder there what's this for where does where's this go so you can get onto the roof and jump across the trees I guess uh, I, I expect this is gonna be like a extra room like second story or something and um, alright let's go back down here and this entrance is really cool they've got like a little piston door here so it opens when you go in it which is uh, really cool and uh, they've got the chest here. I'd lock those. <laughs> yeah. They should probably lock those because those people can steal from those and stuff. Uh, 
I'm not even sure why I can open that. I'm really not. But, um, yeah, I can open these. And they've got a little nether room in here with a lot of netherrack and stuff. I think this is um, Atomic Smiler, Daniel, Daniel Craft MCs, and Cracked Lemons. Um, kind of grouped house because I think they're all friends and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Uh, oh, they, look, they've got a little bit of stained glass up here. And, um, okay, right, let's go up here. It looks like they've got a little room up here where they... Maybe this is supposed to be a bedroom or something. And then, oh, that's awesome. You can see down into the downstairs. Um, and I'm anxious to get into this tower, actually, to see what, what this is about. So, I, I expect this is, like, going to be loads of rooms, like, it's piled on top of each other. And uh, he says, follow me. So, I guess this is, like, the sitting room. I guess. It's got, like... Does that spell out something? I don't think so. I think it's just a load of cobblestone. So, oh, first room for Cracked Lemon. Okay, so that it's just like all of their rooms just like, oh, look, there's Daniel Craft. <laughs> hey, dude. Um, and then this is Daniel Craft MC's room, I guess. He's got a little sofa there and a bed. Yeah, this is really cool, actually. And then I'm guessing the next floor is for Atomic Smiler. And he's got, oh, yeah, his, there's his rewards for the um, 1v1. And then there's his room. Cool, cool. And then what's going to be on the top floor? I guess this is like their secret stash of all of their lost room. <laughs> lost room. So, uh, yeah, this is just all their blocks they've acquired. That's really cool. They've actually got quite a few blocks. And then I'm not sure what this is. There's just a load of ladders everywhere. <laughs> Pointless ladder room. <laughs> okay. So I'm guessing they've just kind of improvised for some of the floors here because they've had too many. And then you get an awesome view across the whole of the thing there. Oh, I really wish I could show... Actually, I probably will show that house this episode. Uh, that's Liam's and um, and uh, Von Bob's house, which is really awesome. I'll go and check that out next. And, oh, he just killed him. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, let's go on to the next base. Alright guys, so now is the base that I really want to showcase this episode. In my opinion, this is probably... <laughs> <laughs> the biggest house on the server just look at that in in my opinion it kind of relates to hogwarts i don't really know why uh and there's a black sheep down there so that's pretty unlucky right so let's start off down here and work up work our way up so we got a sugarcane farm down here where they can you know grow sugarcane make enchantment tables and stuff that's pretty cool and uh i did comment on these stairs actually when we were going up uh because von bob showed me it earlier in the week um i commented that there was no staircases but uh i guess that that that's a work in progress they can add those later <laughs> but um okay so if we go up here uh then we've got a little i guess kitchen type thing we've got a load of furnaces empty chests uh and we've got workbenches here and furnaces that's pretty cool uh i guess and they'll like change the walls later into like i don't know they can do what they want uh, okay, right, I think this is the main room, this is the main entrance just here. Um, so I like the shape of this room, actually. They've got a like, nice, massive glass window across here, so they can look out on the forest. Uh, but there's better views than that to come, by the way. Uh, there's, we've got a skeleton head here, this is probably their mine? I'm not sure, how far does this go down? It just goes down this far, but, yeah, I'm thinking that's their mine, probably. And if we go, yep, this is that this room. And if we go through here, we've got, I guess, a little storage room. So they privated all these chests for them to. And then we've got a nice ladder going up here. So this is when it gets interesting, guys. So up here, we've got a kind of water, water um, elevator type thing to the next floor, which is awesome. Uh, then we've got like more furnaces and stuff that they should really private but oh well <laughs> and then we've got a nice balcony kind of garden thing which i really like um i might think about making i don't know i <laughs> i just i just like the idea of having like a second floor garden i think it's really cool uh, we can see the house we were just in over there uh i'm not sure what this is meant to be maybe they're working on something but i'm not gonna just walk up there i'm gonna go up the water elevator because i'm a badass oh no wait we missed out these two rooms uh, I'm not too sure what that this is. I guess it's kind of like a hole. <laughs> um, and then we got chests just here for both of them. And then we have their beds. Uh, I, I, he told me which bed was whose. 
I think that one's Von Bob's and that one's Liam's, but don't quote me on that. Um, Alright, so next, I guess we've got a ladder up to the second floor as well. Uh, but here's the epic water elevator that goes up to the next floor. So here, I guess we've got a tree full of water. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, this is just so random. And then I guess we could go down here. And then we've got, like, a nice little balcony over here. So we could overlook the surrounding forests and stuff. And, um, okay, let's just get back up here. And then, what does this say? Isn't that just a random sign? Oh, yeah, it's to stop the water from going in there. Fair enough. And, yeah, so that's that. We've got some random never nether portals over there. Um, so if we go up here, then here we have the nether portal, which is one wider, taking advantage of the 1.7 different shaped nether portals. Uh, and in here, I guess this is like a work in progress room. Um, in here, we have the brewing room. <laughs> and my toilet which I can just like get in like this yeah this is my toilet when I came to check out of his house I was just like oh I'm just I'm gonna have to claim this as mine and um, we got a brewing stance here so obviously they've been to the nether and been doing some stuff and actually I think I forgot a room down here did I uh, on this floor I think I forgot about the enchantment room uh, I'm not sure if they've got any bookcases since last time I've looked but uh no, it looks like they're still working on getting the bookcases. And uh, so here's the enchantment room. Pretty pretty good. That'll be good when it's got some bookcases in here. And oh and Ali left. I was gonna check out his base, but I can't really T P to him if um if I I can't really show his base if he's not online really because he keeps it hidden. I mean that's a good idea because then <laughs> you don't get griefed and stuff. Um but yeah, here we have another balcony which looks out on the view. Uh, the only piece of criti criticism I could give here is you kind of scrape your head on the roof, uh, slowly scraping the top of your scalp off <laughs> as you walk around the house. Um, but up here, I think we just have the nether portal, and yeah, that's their house. So, um, yeah, let's move on to the next one. Alright guys, so I forgot about right at the top here, there's an extra floor, and this is actually what we worked on while me and Von Bob were online. We sort of worked on doing this place up and we added a little diving board here and we we made up a little mini game where you had to shoot like jump off shoot the arrow sh jump off and then try and hit yourself so we put our stuff in our chests in case we died really uh, and yeah there's a little diving board here so you can go wee and like jump and I probably shouldn't have jumped then because there's a black sheep and that's bad luck and I should have probably died but um yeah good news Ali's back online so I guess we will check out his base next Alright, so we are at Sir Rockford's base, or Ali's base right now, guys. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I've been here before, and Ali's always been, like, a really good builder um, at building houses like this. And this one's no different, I think. I don't know. He's just, he's just really good at building houses. I mean, like, look at it. It's just awesome. So, he's got a zombie head and a skeleton head there, and then he's got a little entrance. Um... So in this in this room he's got like brewing stuff I guess he's been brewing up potions of regeneration. Uh, he's got like a little water pool here I guess where he gets his water bottles and stuff. Got all of his potion ingredients, uh, furnaces, and yeah that's kind of I guess his alchemy lab or something. Uh, oh yeah, as as the same as the other house he's got this stash of like loads of blocks. I like that idea of like <laughs> having like a stash. Um, and then he's got like a little fire here where he can keep warm and then a view of the surrounding mountains and stuff which is really awesome so if we walk up the stairs here I've never looked up here actually oh we've got like his bedroom with the glitched bed and stuff <laughs> um, and here we've got his chests like arranged in a different layout he's got a lot of stuff he's got some diamond horse armor in there and stuff like that he's got his li little crafting bench there and if we walk along here, oh nice, he's got bookcases, which is awesome. He must have like a sugarcane farm somewhere then. So I do believe you can get level 30. Yeah, you can get level 30 in there. So that's cool. Uh, And yeah, that's it really. Okay, cool. So I'll just show, I'll just show you the outside quickly because I don't think I really showed you much uh, outside. So let's just walk out here. He's got like a load of flowers and stuff. He's got like a nether wart farm over here and all of his horses, they look really cool. He's got a few donkeys, he's got one in gold horse armor over there, which is awesome. 
Uh, he's got his nether portal. That's really cool. I guess that's where he got his brewing stuff from. And, oh, that, that's where Sugar Cane was. Kane was. So he, he's got all of his bookcases. Um, I'm not quite sure that is up there. Maybe that's him working on something. Is that like a paper clip? That actually really looks like a paper clip, but I don't I really don't know. He's got like floating islands up there. And then here is his wheat farm. So uh yeah, Ali does actually do a series on this server guys, so it'd be really, really good if you could go check out his channel. Um it's his, the name of his channel is Sir Rockford, it'll be in the description. And he does a series on the fan server, so if you could go check that out and see how he built this stuff and stuff like that and how he's evolving on the server. Definitely go check that out. He's a really cool guy. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy, then please remember to leave a like. Um, maybe I will do another episode. Oh, he's got fireworks, look. Whee. Um, I might do another episode pretty soon. Um, showcasing some of your other bases. Uh, so, because I know there's a lot of you that aren't online at the moment. And they probably want their bases st shown. You do. Um, so yeah, thank you very much for watching again, and we will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.